They called it the future. The Volanaut Airbike 2025. The first electric flying motorcycle. A sleek, carbon fiber dream promising to liberate us from gridlock. To paint the skies with personal flight. The hype? Unbelievable. But behind the glossy promotional videos, the promises of effortless flight, lies a chilling question. Is this revolution dangerously reckless? Let's peel back the layers of this electric dream and confront the potential nightmares lurking beneath. This isn't just another gadget. It's a vehicle designed to take the skies, placing human lives at the mercy of untested technology. The electric heart of the Volanaut. Efficient? Perhaps. But what happens when that battery malfunctions thousands of feet above ground? What safety redundancies are in place? Unlike a plane or even a helicopter, there's no bulky parachute system here. Consider the learning curve. Are we, the average commuters, ready to become airborne pilots overnight? A motorcycle on the road demands skill and awareness. An air bike in three dimensions? The margin for error shrinks drastically. One wrong move, one unexpected gust, and a dream of personal flight could turn into a devastating fall. The Volanaut Airbike 2025 has landed. But is it a landing on solid ground or the precipice of something far more perilous? Join us as we delve deeper into the risky reality of this electric revolution. The sky may be the limit, but the dangers could be boundless. Death from Above? Unboxing the electric dream and nightmares. The sleek lines and silent hum of the Volanaut Airbike 2025 promise a revolution in personal transport. But beneath the glossy carbon fiber and electric sheen lies a realm of largely untested technology. Are we witnessing innovation or inviting unforeseen dangers into our skies? Forget your morning commute traffic. The Volanaut aims to lift you above it all. But let's dissect this electric dream. Its multi-rotor system, while providing vertical takeoff and landing, introduces a complex web of synchronized movements. What happens if a single rotor malfunctions at 500 feet? Redundancy is claimed, but real-world failure scenarios remain largely theoretical. Then there's the battery, the heart of this electric beast. High energy density is crucial for flight, but so is thermal management and structural integrity. A battery malfunction mid-flight could lead to catastrophic consequences, from sudden power loss to thermal runaway. The fly-by-wire control system, while offering enhanced stability, relies heavily on sophisticated software and sensors. Glitches, cyber intrusions, or even electromagnetic interference could lead to unpredictable behavior. Unlike established aviation, the long-term reliability of these specific integrated systems in a personal flying vehicle context is an unknown quantity. The Volanaut Airbike 2025 is undeniably exciting. But as we gaze skyward, seduced by the promise of effortless flight, a crucial question lingers. Are we early adopters or unwitting participants in a high-stakes experiment? Urban Jungle Chaos Will flying bikes turn cities into danger zones? Imagine your daily commute. Not stuck in gridlock, but navigating a three-dimensional cityscape on your personal fly machine. The Volanaut Airbike 2025 promises this future. But will our urban jungles become exhilarating skies or chaotic danger zones? Consider the sheer volume. Millions of potential airborne commuters. Our current air traffic control systems are designed for large, scheduled aircraft operating in designated corridors. How do you manage thousands of individual flying bikes, each with its own trajectory and destination? Current infrastructure is laughably inadequate. And what about rules of the road, or rather, rules of the sky? Altitude restrictions, no-fly zones, right-of-way at intersections, all need to be established and, crucially, enforced. Will we see airborne traffic cops pulling over reckless flyers? The logistics are mind-boggling. Noise pollution is another critical factor. The constant whirring of countless electric rotors could transform the urban soundscape into an unbearable drone. Imagine trying to have a conversation or sleep with a swarm of air bikes buzzing outside your window. Emergency scenarios take on a whole new dimension. A mid-air malfunction over a crowded street? A sudden downdraft causing a loss of control near skyscrapers? 
The potential for catastrophic accidents increases exponentially in a dense urban environment. First responders would face unprecedented challenges. The future of flight or a fatal flop. So, the Volonaut Airbike 2025. A tantalizing glimpse into the future or a potentially fatal misstep. We've explored the untested tech, the urban airspace chaos, the battery anxieties, and the pilot error possibilities. The inherent risks are undeniable, a tightrope walk between groundbreaking innovation and potential disaster. The viability hinges on rigorous safety protocols, robust regulatory frameworks that are currently playing catch-up, and a level of pilot training far exceeding that of a motorcycle license. Without these ironclad guarantees, the risky revolution could indeed become, ultimately, the Volonaut represents a gamble, a bet on technology outpacing potential pitfalls. While the dream of personal flight is compelling, the current landscape suggests a cautious approach. Our verdict? The Volonaut Airbike 2025, in its current iteration, leans precariously toward a high-stakes experiment with an unacceptably high margin for error. The future of flight it promises remains, for now, firmly grounded in uncertainty.